Hi, brothers and sisters. Welcome to Seeds of the Word. Quite often I meet Christians, and the thing that they keep saying, and the thing that they keep feeling, is that the best part of my Christian life, the best thing to ever happen in my Christian life, is going to happen at some distant point in the future. But that is the biggest lie that you could ever believe. Because the word of God in 2 Corinthians chapter 1 verse 20 says, All the promises of God are a yes and an amen in Christ for the glory of God through us. Think about that for a second. Every promise that God has ever made is a yes and an amen in Jesus. Every single promise, whether it is a promise about health, whether it is promise about everlasting life, immortality, health, blessing, freedom from curse, whether it is a promise about 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 uh, protection from every everything, whether it is a promise that nothing shall by any means harm you, whether it is a promise about about that uh, about the fact that everything that you put your hand to will prosper, whether there is a promise that, 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 that every sick person that you put your hand on will be healed and every dead person can be raised if you just speak in faith. Listen, every promise of God is a yes and an amen in Jesus. The best things in your life are not going to happen, my dear brother, my dear sister. It's already happened the moment you've accepted Christ. Because inside of you is the Spirit of God. And inside of you is this life that if you would just accept and become aware of the presence of the living God inside of you, everything will change. Every promise of God is a yes and an amen in Christ. Every promise, everything that is ever promised in this world is a yes and an amen. It's not something that you've got to grasp. It's not something that you've got to, you've got to try and do something to achieve. It's not something that you've got to work to get. No, no, no. It is a yes and an amen in Jesus. So today, rest with this truth. Rest tonight. Rest with this truth that every promise of God is a yes and an amen. In Jesus. It's a yes and an amen, which means it's done and it's true. But what if I don't see it in my life? What if I don't see it happening? That's when I've got to decide whether I believe what I see. My faith is in His Word. And if my faith is in His Word, I can assure you one thing what He says, He always keeps up to. Every promise is a yes and an amen. Tell yourself that. Tell your mind that. Tell your emotions. Half the problems that we have are our mind and our emotions not cooperating with the truth of the word of God. You've got to renew your mind. You want to see transformation in your life? Renew your mind. That's the only way you are guaranteed transformation in the word of God. Don't be like the world. Don't look like the world. Don't walk like the world. Don't live like the world. Be transformed, renew your mind according to the word of God. Remember, every promise of God is a yes and an amen in Christ. God bless you. God bless you. Go ahead and live a blessed, fruitful, healthy life.